Doris. Why did you take me here? What is this? I don't know what, what, what you took me here for. Oh, Charles, don't be so stubborn. You're going to love this restaurant. I'm going to love I'm hungry. I want to eat a, a good dinner, and you take me here. I mean, I, I, I don't know what I'm going to eat here. I mean, what is it? The Vitality Health Food Kitchen. What is there to eat here? I don't know. This happens to be one of the finest restaurants in New York. They serve only health foods here. The meals are all highly vitaminized and planned by a dietary specialist. Yeah, but I'm, I'm, what about good health to you, madam? Good health to you. Good health to you, sir. And good health to you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have a table in just a moment. Yes. Health to you. What was that? Good health to you. <laughs> Look, Doris, I don't want to eat here. I mean, let's not experiment. Huh? I'm hungry now. I don't want to experiment. If I eat someplace else, maybe I'll experiment with you. But look, why don't we go to Pepito's, huh? We can get those nice uh, spiced snails, you know, and then we can get those hot tamales with the red sauce, and then we can have the, uh, some, 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 some more snails, and then we can have some pickles with the hot mustard, and we can have the spiced sausages, you know? After all, why take chances with your stomach? I don't know what I'm <laughs> that's just the trouble with you, Charles, stuffing all that poison in your stomach. One meal here, and you see how much better you'll feel. One meal, that's Look, all. I don't want to feel better after a meal. I want to feel full. Now, if I go to Pepito's and make a meal after the meal, it's... What? I know I ate. Charles, you're going to thank me for bringing you here. These dietetic foods add years to your life. They give you vim and vigor. Look, look. What? See that couple over there, right there on the side? Which one? The dough? Right yeah. there. Yeah. They have been eating here for years. Now, how old would you say he is? He'll be around 28, 29 years old. 84. 84. <laughs> I mean, the guy with the crew haircut. Mm -hmm. 84 years old. <laughs> Boy, he kept himself in good shape, I'll say that. It turned out all right, too. Look at the young chick with him. <laughs> That's his mother. That's his mother. <laughs> oh, the Italian boy haircut. That's the mother. <laughs> Your table is ready now. Oh, thank oh, you so Thank much. you very much. Charlie! Well, Charlie Hickenlooper. Mr. Fleming, how, how are, are you, you, Nice sir? to see you. Fine. Uh, oh, uh, Mr. Fleming, I don't think you've met my wife. Well, how, how do you do, do, do Mrs. Hickenlooper? Uh, Mr. Fleming, yeah. Mm -hmm. What are you doing here, Mr. Fleming? Oh, well, a very good friend of mine has been eating here for years and suggested that I try it, so I thought I would. <laughs> well, that's a coincidence. I'm eating here for the first time also. Is that so? Yes, Doris took me. <laughs> well, well uh, uh, enjoy your meal. Very nice, nice meeting you. you. So nice, nice meeting you. Bye-bye. 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 Thank you. Where do you know Mr. Fleming from? Uh, I always see him eating at Pepito's. He's been eating the Pepito's for about, oh, years now. Oh, nice old man. 23. <laughs> good health to you, madam. Good health to you, sir. Good health to you. And good health to you, good health. I'll be with you in a moment. Well, I hope the food is good, because I'm starved. <laughs> well, let's dig in. <laughs> What's the matter with you? People look at you, it's not nice. I mean, can't you wait till the waiter comes? Charles, these are health food hors d'oeuvres. They're the blossoms of the polypaca plant. The polypaca plant? The polypaca plant. They're loaded with sodium oxide. Very good for your ankles. Try one. And if you like them, I'll get a bouquet. We'll keep them around the house for snacks. Well, that'll be good. <laughs> Next time we go out, next time we go out, we'll eat separately. I'll eat at Pepito's, and you can eat at the Botanical Garden somewhere. I can cultivate a taste for these things, darling. Where do you taste the other dishes? You'll love them. Your menu? <laughs> Did you enjoy your palapacas? Oh, delicious the as always. yeah. Vegetable protein derivative. Yeast extract, low-sodium manganese salad. <laughs> I can't make up my mind. Everything sounds so yummy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what are you going to have, Charles? I don't know. What would you suggest, Doctor? <clears throat> well, how about a nice uh, vitamin B1, B2, B3, C, D, and H dinner for two? It's very nice. Oh, that sounds like too much for me. Yeah. I'll just have the homogenized bone meal, wheat germ, and a side order of glucose. I'm sorry, madam, but glucose doesn't come with the wheat germ. I could let you have crotose, 
Oh, I don't like throat toast. Have you any fur toast? Not on Fridays. No fur toast on Fridays. How about a nice <laughs> dish of ceratos? All right, I have ceratos with a birch bark dressing. Certainly. Birch bark. One ceratos with birch bark dressing, and you, sir? I'll have an elm tree on rye. <laughs> Elms are out of season. You sell them here. I know that, yeah. Well, well, I don't know. What would you suggest I have? Well, how about a nice penicillin pudding? Penicillin pudding? <laughs> you set it with a hypodermic or you take it nasally. What do you do? <laughs> Darling, why don't you have a steak? Steak? Sure. Where? Where's the steak? Right there. Steak, oh. A vitality steak made of broccoli germ, <laughs> asparagus gluten, carrot dextrose, and celery. And with that, you get two vegetables. Oh, I need them very much. <laughs> it looks like real steak. Look, I don't want anything that looks like real steak. I want real steak. When I have to pay for it, I have to pay for it with real money. So if I want a steak, I have to pay for it with real money. I want a real steak. But they don't serve me, dear. Well, then let's go somewhere else. Where we... Hey, what is he eating? I'll, I'll have that, that, uh, that spaghetti. I'll have that, yeah. That's not spaghetti, sir. That's spaghetti. Uh, <laughs> Average extract and cauliflower derivative. It looks like spaghetti, so we call it spaghetti. <laughs> well, I'll have a veal kitlet with some ravioli on the side. Yes, sir, one veal kitlet with one ravioli. You save it here? Yeah. Can we go with the pussy willow dressing? Yeah, bring the pussy willows with the ravioli. Might as well, pussy willows with the ravioli. Look, I hope this food is good, dear, because I'm really starved. Keep you know an I mean? open mind, Charles. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you know